another video so for today as y'all saw by the title we're gonna be doing a Canadian citizenship test and if you did not know I am Canadian parents are Jamaican so Jamaican Canadian Jamaican and so yeah I found this random test online hopefully it works I'm gonna lean well not lean back but I'm gonna stick to the side here so that way y'all can see my screen to the for you I guess it's over here I'm not even going to do left and right over here and let's go so let's see so i'm on the screen let me just hit screen record right quick okay so i found another test i don't know if i should do the chapter test i'm gonna do a simulation simulation test okay this is a simulation test of the official Canadian citizenship test, exact same formula as the official test. So hopefully, your girl can get higher than a 55, cause I mean, that's that's like a passing grade. But okay, let's go. Barely a pass. That's a failing grade. What am I talking about? In the comments, someone tell me what a 55 is if you're still in high school. Because I don't remember. I think that's failing, but whatever. Okay. Oh, I have 30 minutes. Okay, cool. What are the three main groups of original people? First Nation, Maybe, and Inuit. French, English. I mean, I know where it's going to go. Okay. Who was John Bu Buchan? Buchan? Let's say a father of confederation. When did the House of Commons recognize that the Quebecois form a nation within United Canada? I don't know. Who is Major, major, majority, major Turner Bailey. Because I'm black, I'm gonna go with the black loyalists. Cause I don't know. I don't think we had a. Female Prime Minister. We haven't had a female Prime Minister. First Canadian female athlete. Maybe. I'm going to say Olympian. You know. When did English settlement begin in Canada? 1497. We're just going to go with the oldest. 1497. Who established the first European settlement? The English. Yeah, because we are connected to the Queen. So, who passed the Quebec Act of 1774? I'm going to say British. Which act granted to the Canada's for the first... Which act granted to the Canada's for the first time legislative assemblies elected by the people? The Federation Act? The Freedom Act? Which act granted to the Canadian, to the Canada's for the first time? I want to say the Freedom Act. Or is it the Confederation? Confederation... <laughs> You're gonna say freedom. I got 26 minutes left out of 30. Who was the Lieutenant Colonel John Graves Simco? I work in the first name. I don't know how to the city of Toronto. Simco sounds familiar, but I don't remember if we've seen it in Toronto or Ottawa. I'm going to say Upper Canada. What did the British Parliament abolish? When? Oh, can I read? When did the... When, when did the British 
Parliament abolished slavery throughout the empire. Oh no, we just gonna go with that. Name three fathers of confederation. McDonald, Cartier, I think it's this one. I think that's that one. Which phrase embodies the vision of the mean of uh, which phrase embodies the vision for the dominion of Canada? For Canada, my home and that's the national anthem. Dominion from sea to sea and from the river to the end of the earth. The last was America, right? The land of the strong, free and strong. <laughs> Dominion. What is Dominion? What? I'm just gonna guess because I don't know what that is. Which portrait is on the Canadian ten dollar bill? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? It's either McDonald or I'm gonna say McDonald because I don't know. It's either McDonald's or Cartier. And watch it, watch it be wrong. Watch it be one of the, the other two people. <laughs> what made it possible for immigrants to settle to Western Canada? The completion of the Canadian National Railway. The completion of the Canadian Pacific Railway. It's something about the it's something about the railway. I know that. National Pacific. National Pacific. Oh my God. I'm going to say specific. Pacific. You know what it says. Oh my God. It has to be something about the railway, but I don't know. When were the Canada and Quebec pension plans devised? Let's say 1970. What is la Franco Francophonie? Francophonie? The Francophone. A French music instrument? I don't know. I don't think that's an instrument, you know. A region in Quebec. I'm gonna say an association because I don't know what. Why is Terry Fox a national career Canadian hero? Um, he he was not a hockey player. He wasn't in the nineteenth century. Cancer research. That's the one. What are the responsibilities of the federal government? Federal. What are the types of government again? I'm, a little, I'm not cheating, y'all. I just want to know what the types of governments are. Because something sorry about that my phone was about to die <laughs> who okay now i got 20 minutes okay who has the right to vote in a federal election okay and on the voters list it is it's between one and three because permanent residents can they vote? Can can permanent resident? That's so bad because 
get to be at least 18 years. I know that. I'm gonna say that. Where do where do the majority of Canadians live? In cities. I fail. Wow. Wow. Test result. Fail. They didn't they they didn't cut any punches. This is a big fat old um fail right on the screen. That's so sad. Your score is seventy percent. Fourteen correct answers out of twenty. In the official test. Wow, so all I needed was five five more points and I would have passed. Seventy percent is still good, because you know, in high school, seventy percent is like a B. So I got a B. Let's put it that way, okay? So question one, I got right. Question two, who was John Buchan, or however you say his name, a popular governor in Canada? You know that. When did the House of Commons, oh, I got that right, correct. Ooh, I guess, Black Loyalist, here we go, Turner Bailey. When did English settlement begin in Canada? 1610. Actually, that sounds familiar. That does sound familiar. Who is that? It was the French. It was. Yo, I'm dumb. Half of Canada speaks French. But. Okay. Who passed the Quebec Act of 1774? British Parliament got that right. Which act granted in Canada for the first time was the assembly? Constitutional act. Isn't that what I said? But wasn't that if we go back in the footage, is that what I said? Constitutional? I should have went with my first instinct. <sighs> now question nine, who was caught who was current colonel? John Gray Simcoe got that right. When did the British Parliament abolish slavery? 1833. Didn't know that. Question 11 named three confederal fathers of confederation. I knew that. Shout out to my middle school that made us do the clan assemblies and all that fun stuff. Which phrase embodies? The vision. Ooh, I even guessed the man from sea to sea and the river from the ends of the earth. Bro. Which portrait? Number 13. I got that right. Sir John McDonald. <laughs> what made it possible for immigrants to settle in Western Canada? I got that right. 15. I do not know about pension. I'm sorry. I would have not gotten that right. Well, I knew it wasn't. A, I was like, what the heck is La Francophone? And I, like, I have never heard that instrument. So it had to be an association. Terry Fox, y'all, if you're Canadian, you know who Terry Fox is, period. What are the responsibilities of the federal government? Uh, who has the right to vote? Knew it. Where do majority of Canada li Canadians live? Cities, bruh, bruh. Five. I don't care what any, I don't care what it says. I passed. Fourteen out of twenty. Fourteen out of twenty. Like, so I got six wrong. Right? So I, I'm not gonna math either. Six wrong. Ew. Failed. That's so. That's so. Depressing, but I passed in my heart. I know I passed. <sighs> well, thank you for watching this video. If you stayed this far to the end, 
thank you for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and stay tuned for the next video i'm probably gonna do the jamaican citizenship test next and i'm probably gonna fail i'm probably gonna fail if i got a 70 for canada let's see what jamaica has to say all right share this video don't forget to like comment subscribe and you know your girl will be back with another video in due time. They're calling me the